Hi, I'm Matt and welcome to Cunis Car Combos. Today we're talking about family golf nights at Majestic Oaks Golf Course at Lake Lawn Resort. We'll be chatting with Joe Serpico in this amazing supercharged Shelby F-150. <laughs> Thanks for doing this, Joe. Yeah, not a problem. I got something really special for us to drive today. Is it that Shelby? Yep. Oh, no it's way. 775 horsepower. <laughs> Should be fun, though. All right. I'm assuming you'll drive it for the conversation, though. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Cunis car convo? No, buddy. We can't take the chance you're going to drive this the way you drive your golf balls right through the rough. <laughs> We're here today with Wait, the really? Cunis cart convo well i mean so we're not going in there sense. i mean i guess the cart makes sense it's a golf video then why'd you even bring this <laughs> well you know maybe we'll drive it later oh wait really yep what the heck enjoy <laughs> all right well guess it's another golf cart in my life all right joe well thanks for joining us for yeah. our cunis cart convo first ever um, so we're going to talk about family golf nights here at Majestic Oaks. Do you give us a you know, sort of an overview of what happens on family golf nights? Yeah, so family golf nights, they're going to run from Sundays through Thursdays after 4 o'clock. So anytime at 4 o'clock, Sunday through Thursday, families can come on out. And to be basically qualified to participate in it, you have to have at least one player in your group uh, who would be under 17 or under, so he's a junior. Um, and as long as you meet that criteria, then you can participate in junior golf or in the family golf. And it's going to be $14 per person, even for the adults. You get nine, yeah, you get nine holes of golf, and then you're also going to be able to stop into the clubhouse restaurant when you're all done and get a, a snack. You can get either chips or a candy bar, as well as a, a fountain drink, uh, all included in that $14. Nice. So it's it's a pretty great rate. And it's really just trying to get some families out and teach the, the game of golf, you know, arguably the, the greatest game ever created. Yep, um, so yeah, just trying to get the younger generation into it and do it in a cost-effective manner because obviously golf is a pretty expensive sport. So where we can yep. you know, save some money for the parents who are trying to get their kids to learn golf, uh, it's kind of a win-win. Nice, that's cool. So that's kind of the inspiration is just to offer an affordable way for kids to get into it. Yeah, yeah. It also creates a nice environment. You know, you come out and enjoy the beautiful scenery with the family. In today's day and age, everything just costs so much money. You walk out of the house, you feel like you dropped $100. Okay. <laughs> so just okay. to provide an environment even just to come on out and, and have fun with the family. Awesome. So did you say there's specific days and times? Yes. So Sunday through Thursday. So not on Fridays and Saturdays, but Sunday through Thursday, and it starts after four o'clock. So anytime after four o'clock, come on out. Um, we do recommend to make a tea time. Um, they're not required by any means, but uh, we are getting busier as we're getting into the season. So, you know, if you show up and, and our tea sheet's pretty full, unfortunately, we have to send the people who have the tea times first. So sure. it's recommended, sense. but not required. Okay, great. So, um, do you offer like equipment rentals yeah. uh, for the kids and adults? Or what yep, do you got we do offer? have a variety of rental sets for adults and children. Um, for the kids, we have different heights. So, cause obviously kids bend on their age, they're, they're different heights. So we do have multiple sets for the kids um, that do have different heights. So that's um, a great little asset for us, yeah. as well as we do have the adult rentals as well. Um, okay. And there's a, you know, nine hole child so it's again pretty pretty affordable awesome awesome okay so how do you structure it on the course um, do, do the do the adults play from the normal tees and what do the kids do yeah so actually everybody's gonna play from our family golf set of tees okay um, so that is on the par fours you're hitting from the 150 yard marker okay. and then on the par fives you're gonna hit from the 200 yard marker and on the par threes you're gonna be hitting from the actual red tee boxes. So the red tees um, that are on the course would be the part threes. Okay. So, and that's for everybody, that's not just the kids. So okay. um, the, the, fam the adults will also join the kids at these family golf tees. Gotcha, gotcha. Makes sense, that keeps things moving yeah. along, you know. Yeah, it's kind of hard to get a nice flow if you're having to stop at three different sets of tees for mom and dad and junior. Right. So right. it's just, 
it's just nice to have everybody go to the same spot and, and work from there. Makes sense, makes a lot of sense. So do you have any good feedback or stories from the golf, family golf nights so far? Yeah, I mean, I think that the people that participate in them currently, um, they love it. They keep coming back for more. I think definitely, and part of what we're here today doing is to promote it because I think that once the word gets out about it, it's it's just gonna run away. I, I feel like it's, it's definitely an in-demand thing to have affordable golf and, and have an environment where the family can come out and the kids can get this experience in a kind of, you know, judgment-free zone, if you will. Sure. Um, so I think I think that this and other things that we're doing to help promote it are just going to help take it to the next level. But yeah, everybody that has done it is is very much enjoying it. Good, good. I'm sure. That's great. So, are there any other you know special events or themes that you know adults or kids or either or should be uh, in the know about at Majestic Oaks this season? <clears throat> Um, no themes. Um, the only other event that we really host is, uh, so we already did our craft brew, or excuse me, our salt the rim uh, back on May 4th. So that's always out of our kickoff one for the season, and it's Cinco de Mayo themed. And then our end of the season one, um, we haven't pinned down a date yet, but it'll be probably sometime in September, and that's the craft brew open. So that's more of a German fest type theme, okay. and um, a lot of beer tasting and beer vendors out here for that so that's really our, our only two events we have so keep your eyes open for when we release the date of the craft brew open and um, yeah last year we had a great turnout for it yeah so it sounds like a lot of fun yeah I might have to come out for that one um, okay and then um, I guess how do people uh, just kind of where do we point people to come out and you know, find more information about Majestic Oaks yeah so you could you could go to the Lake Lawn Resort web page or Facebook page and you'll be able to find the information in there um, as well as you could always just call the golf shop um, you know we have the the staff that's ready to share the information and book your tee times um, you won't be able to find the family golf online if you're booking online so to book for family golf I would definitely call the pro shop and uh, get it settled that way because sometimes you end up having to pay a booking fee if you book online but this way you won't have to pay online you just pay when you get into the shop um, okay. and you don't you're not overpaying by any means all right that's good advice yeah. all right well i think that's all the questions i have do you want to go for a ride in that shelby truck i would love to let's go all right sweet all right oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> Not bad for a F-150. Highway 43, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of this thing? I think this thing is awesome. <laughs> How much say it was? <laughs> I, I don't remember what they're at now. Probably around 140,000 or so. Well, I mean. You're up there. It is a nice drive and you got a flat screen. Right, it's, yeah. That thing is massive. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're, you're paying for all that horsepower, yeah. though, oh, yeah. you'll find out. Which I'm <laughs> yeah, shortly. <laughs> hey, so. Seats have AC. I didn't, I didn't realize that at first. Yeah, I want to turn mine on. That's, um, that's pretty great. Yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a wonderful thing. Yeah. All right, now the fun can start. <laughs> Just gotta sit and listen to that. Right? right? <laughs> it's a little bit better pickup than my GP. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, a little bit. You know what's great is how, how nice these ride. You know, these are like, they're lifted, right? Yeah. I think it's about, it's not a massive lift. I, I think it's a three inch lift or a four inch lift. But they still ride and drive so nice. But that's the beauty of these things. And these are honestly, even at this price point, we sell a lot of these Shelby trucks. Really? Like we ship them all over the country. Um, I mean, oh, it's it handles fantastic. It's smooth. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we we at a certain point, and I don't. I'd have to check with the Ford dealer, but at a certain point, our Delavan Ford store was the number one seller in the country of these trucks. Wow. So, um, 
Shelby yeah. was loving Hunis. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, they definitely like. We always have a lot of them in stock, and we, you know, we have a good selection, different colors. They, they you know, they have specific colors they come in. We yeah. always have a variety of the colors, yeah. and we always have plenty to pick from. No, it's it's the perfect level, I think, of luxury. Um, muscle and luxury. Muscle and luxury. Get yeah. married in this vehicle. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 